Welcome to Learn Yourself. Write these sums, page number 88, 1. Start with the same step, x equals to 5, and make two different equations. Ask two of your classmates to solve the equation. Check whether they get solution x equals to 5 or not. So first we have to make two equations and then we have to solve. So first let us make equation. So to make equation, first we are using this expression that x equals to 5. Now this is our x equals to 5. Now to make equation I am going to add any one number at both the side. So first let us add 3 at both the side. So x plus 3 equals to 5 plus 3. This is RHS and this is our LHS. So at both the side I have added 3. So I will get here x plus 3 equals to 5 plus 3, 8. So this is going to be my first equation. Now let us make another equation. So to make equation, now we know that we have to use this x equals to 5. Now any operation we are doing, addition, subtraction, division or multiplication, we have to do it at both the side. First, I have added something here. Now, in this equation, when I am making second equation, I am multiplying something. So, I am writing, let's multiply 2 at both the side. So, I am multiplying 2 at both the side and here is my expression. So, x into 2, I can write 2x equals to 10. Now, this is my second expression. Now we have to solve it and see that whether we are getting x equals to 5 and here also x equals to 5 equation back or not. So I am going to solve this both of this equation and let us check that whatever we have guessed earlier that x equals to 5 is still true or not. So now let us write our solution. Let us find out the solution. So our expression here is going to be x plus 3 equals to 8. Now when we are solving expression, when we are solving equation, what we are doing first we are separating the variable. So our variable is x here. So let us separate this variable. If I want to separate this variable, I have to remove this number. So subtract with 3 at both the end. By doing so, my x variable will be alone and separated. So like this and at both the side. So minus 3. Now this 3 and this 3 will get cancelled out and x equals to I will get 8 minus 3, 5. So I got my x equals to 5 solution back. Let us do the same thing for this. So what is our equation? It is 2x equals to 10. Now to make my variable separate which is multiplied by 2, I have to divide this both the side with 2. So when I will divide both the side with 2, it is going to be 2x divided by 2 equals to 10 divided by 2. So this 2 and this 2 will get cancelled out. I have separated my variable that is x equals to 2 5s are 10. So x equals to 5, I got it back. So that is how I try this sums page number 88 second. Try to make two number puzzles, one with solution 11 and another with solution 100. So we are going to make two puzzle. This is puzzle number one and this is going to be our puzzle number two. So puzzle number 1 we have to make it such that its solution should be 11 and puzzle number 2 should be such that its solution or the answer will be 100. So let us see this puzzle that take first even number, first even number multiplied with 5 and add 1. Now we have to find out that what is this first even number. Even number and that too very first even number is 2 multiplied with 5. So 2 we have to multiply with 5 and add 1. And then after that we have to add 1. 
So when we will multiply this, we will get 10. And by adding this one, we will get solution as 11. So this is going to be our first puzzle. Now let us check puzzle number two, which is with solution 100. It says that take first two digit number. First two digit number is 10 multiplied with 9. So I'm going to multiply it here with 9 to the answer to the answer. So let us find out the answer that is 90. Now this is answer to the answer again add first two digit number. So again we have to add 10. So this will give us 100 as a solution. So like this with little complexity you can make a different kinds of puzzle. So thank you for watching and learning with us. If you have any doubt, please comment down below. I'll see you in next video. Till then, keep learning, keep sharing. And don't forget to subscribe, learn yourself.